what's up everybody welcome back to another video from exotic astrology and today we will discuss on something very crucial for those who are in the path of spiritual realization and before beginning as i always say god is there with you all the time just look to him and he will be there to help you realize your original spiritual identity and if you have not subscribed to the channel yet then please subscribe to it and share the video with everybody else and if you like this video then press the like button and if you are happy with me making these videos and you want me to make these videos in future and if you feel that you can give some kind of a donation then the paypal link is there below the video in the description you can go and give some contribution voluntarily if you wish or else continue watching this video <laughs> what are the symptoms of spiritual advancement there's a lot of talk in the community about spiritual advancement spiritual realization spiritual upliftment have you ever heard what are the traits well we shall discuss about it in short we will discuss about them in detail later to discuss on this i have to go to the shrimad bhagavatam i have to quote from there because the answer is there in the shrimad bhagavatam shrimad bhagavatam says there are three symptoms one two three see let us explain and try to understand this in some in a very gross way for example how do you know a person has eaten something or he likes to eat or how do you know for example if the person is eating and he is feeling great delight in eating yes then you know that he is enjoying the activity and the second point is when he is going on eating his hunger is getting down his cravings are going down slowly because he is becoming full from within yes and later on what happens when he finishes eating he gets a lot of strength in his body to lift big big blocks to go to the gym to beat somebody in the face <laughs> which clearly goes and tells that three symptoms of spiritual advancement is as follows the first one is you are getting taste in spiritual activities taste means you are wanting to do them more and more chanting the names of god hearing more about god and his stories associating more with holy men associating more with those people who are connected to god associating more with those people who are connected to divine knowledge instead of associating with those people who are having no conception of the higher reality adhato brahma jigyasa inquire about the higher truth that is what the scriptures say so that is the first symptom more and more taste more and more relishment of the spiritual activities the second is as per that analogy that your stomach is filled what what does it mean it means that all the materialistic cravings go down they will reduce that is the second symptom all the problems of the mind will go down your mind will become calm peaceful joyful cheerful from within that is another symptom of spiritual advancement 
and what is the third as i said getting strength in the hands to do things which means he will want to give spiritual knowledge to others that is what is the meaning of this because he is himself so full that now the what happens when there's a glass of water you are going on pouring water then after some time it will get full and then it will explode right overflow which means he will preach about god he will also want others to take to spirituality by this you know if the person is advancing there you go therefore if you see some guru or some spiritual personality or whoever you call quote and quote spiritual or religious and you do not see these traits these three traits well then maybe it's a time that we question ourselves are we following the right people this is the verdict of the shrimad bhagavatam this is not my verdict <laughs> there is nothing of my original flavor here it's all from the scriptures tushti pushti shuddha payana that's where from this reference that's the place from where you get this reference tushti pushti shuddha payana <laughs> So there you go three symptoms of spiritual advancement what is the first first is more and more happiness joy delight in spirituality in hearing about god in speaking about god and doing things spiritual things second is cessation of materialistic desires and hankerings and troubles of the mind and third is power to pull others into spirituality that is the third he becomes like a magnet where every who to whom everybody is helplessly drawn to okay so that is it from my side if you have any questions queries or comments then please let me know in the comment section or else if you know somebody who has these three symptoms then please mention their contact details below or we can arrange an interview with them because these are very rare things that you see there you go bye bye see you tata